Legend of Total War here with part 11 of my Europa Universalis Let's Play campaign as Rome. On the last episode, took a huge portion of the, uh, of Gaul away from Massalia. Oh, Massilia, whatever. Um, now what? Uh, I'm just trying to remember what I did last. What I was going to do. Probably just consolidate for a few turns. And well, turns, just a little while. Maybe take Gaul. Don't see any reason why I couldn't. They still need some men, extra men over here. What's available? There's cavalry here. Yeah, let's just get two lots of equities. Don't mind getting more expensive troops. And I can get prin uh, mercenary prin uh, Prinkipes. Hmm. That could actually be really good. A mercenary army that costs me money, but not anything in manpower. I like the idea of that. Alright, let's see. I want them to be Prinkipes, of course. Let's see what's available. Ah, uh, with each mercenary I get, they cost a little bit more. The fuck? Uh. Now I can deal with what I've got. I don't need mercenaries just yet. I think. For Conti, right, what's going on there? Okay, so I'm gaining at a rate of two, 928 a month. Extra men in the recruitment pool. Interesting. The more times you recruit the uh, mercenaries, the more expensive they get. I think I can rely on just on, on my on my main troops. Pretty sure I can. Yeah, whatever. That doesn't matter. Leave Egypt alone. I don't give a shit. Growing at a pretty quick rate. My guys keep dying. Okay, one well, lot of cavalry needs to come down this way. A lot over here, I think. Yep. Very good. Bloody says it right there how many population it's got. I can't believe it. I'd be fucking blind. 10.3. Shit, here I was fucking adding up these values like a moron. Well, that's good. Nothing wrong with extra civilization. I'd like this to get an additional 5%. That would be great. Then it would be at a hundred percent. Character loyalty, whatever. This will be ready to expand soon. Where is this happening? 
Moritani, where, where's that? Over there. Well, I need to make sure my guy's there. In the immediate. Well, that's good. That should mean, yep, there's no more barbarians in Numidia to simply increase the population there. A horde of four units will spawn over here. Just wait for my guy to get into position. Actually, considering trying to get Blessing of Cupid, because it'll increase population growth by 5% for one year. Let's have a look. Did it work? Ah, uh, it did. I took a risk and it won. And do that. Roman Hellenistic. Yeah, whatever. Good. And absorbed them, so no more barbarians there. Good, this is growing. Population is 11 people. Good. So that growth of 9%. So there's 78 people here. Does that mean at the end of this year it's going to grow by... Um, Fucking ten, pe uh, eight people. I doubt that. But we'll see exactly what this. I'm still. I still struggle to to understand what this pop population growth means. And that hasn't done on a monthly basis. That doesn't seem to do anything. Now, does that population growth mean that it's going to increase the population by 0.09 people? Don't know. Or well, by 0.9? Oh, what was this? Four barbarians on its way to gather some of being up. Yes, well, let's not let that happen. 16th of... Okay, we'll get there before them. Very good. How's my war exhaustion? It's gone. How's my reputation? Horrible. Maybe I should go to war with these guys. But then again, this is... Anytime I go to war, it's just gonna basically throw away my uh, recruitment pool. I'm still trying to understand exactly what the population growth actually means. So it's 78.2. I'm assuming in January it's going to adjust. That's my assumption. Yeah. What are they doing? They're just going to go north, are they? Fucking... Oh, they're going to pick up a, a load of troops over here. Oh, because this region was looted, it loses public, uh, population growth. Which fucks. Now, hang on. That just grew up by a little bit. So it does seem to adjust monthly. It just doesn't seem to adjust by very much at all. Units on its way over here. Don't let them go there. So they arrive 6th of January, we arrive 1st of January. We'll get there before them. Good. 
good manpower is increasing by small amounts. Better than nothing. Disloyal fuck. We'll just need to wait for him to die then. How old are you? 51? Well, you've got no wealth. Not well. It's your own fucking fault. Actually, he's a pretty good general. Oh well. Okay, yeah. So a large portion just got increased then at the end of the year. Pretty much 0 .09, 0 0.9. So that's what it means. Is it equal in all regions? This was at, fuck off. Uh, this was at what? Nope. That increased by 0 0.1 of a person. So it is by a percent, it is by a percentage. Right. Maybe it's 9% a decade. It's not transparent though, what it means. It's, it's hard to understand. Good. Wait, how old are you again? Could die. Could expand into here if this um, was down to uh, one or two. There's no reason why we can't get that started. All we need to do, of course, is hire a velity. I'm thinking I could actually support a mercenary army. Let's see what it's like. I can certainly afford it. It doesn't cost me any manpower, so why not? Uh, I don't like the looks of this. Where do they think they're going? They go here. At the very least, if they decide to go to Rayetia, I can decide to stop moving. Yeah, I think that's the right thing to do. Yep, just go stand there and piss them off. this way. Seems like there's a much larger problem in the north than in the south. In fact, the south doesn't seem to be a big problem at all. So they're going to Cisalpine Gaul and we'll beat them there. Very good. It's always good to defend the region rather than attack it. Even though if I was fighting this battle in a total war game, I'd much prefer to be on the attack. Okay, we're kicking ass over here. That's great. It's one down. What's the upkeep cost on these guys? 0 0.032, yeah, whatever. As opposed to, okay, so they're twice as expensive as regular units, and that's fine with me, because let's face it, 
My guys are dirt cheap at the moment. The more regions I have, the more I can um, sustain. Of course, I've, I've got tons of money rolling in it. And of course, with all these barbarians keep coming, then just make even more money. Okay, Blessing of Cupid is over. It made a small difference. You better not fucking fail me. Oh, you piece of shit. You, down here. Put a stop to him. Lost a lot of popularity. Whatever. So how many are we up against here? In total, it looks like... What is this? So four plus... About 10,000 men. So not as many as it actually says there. And with their morale so low, they're not going to assault it. How long until that we arrive? 31st of December? Yep. Really disappointed that they lost. You suck. Egypt assassinating my guys. Whatever. What's this? That'd be useful if I was building stuff right now. taking attrition on top of that. What about my guys? No attrition. Okay, how are we going? Come on. Scoring a fucking zero, that's pathetic. That's when we're gonna lose again. Very good. Uh oh, here comes some more. That's only four of them. Where are the rest of those going? They're going to Paleo. Uh, no, they're going to Rietia. Could colonize Rietia. Can't colonize history, so. Yep, send them. So now the population here is at 8.5, so... And this one's been reduced as well. Yeah. Because it takes two from the bordering region and two from Rome. When colonizing. Two from the capital. So these guys, it's a static cost, that's fine, and a mercenary general. I need to call this 10th legion mercs. So these are, gu these are the guys that we send on suicide missions, essentially, because they only cost me money. away from mercenaries. Shit, they're bringing... Oh, they're not bringing more. Whatever. When 
am I going to go war with these guys? Good, that's those guys dealt with. Population growth. Fuck. Good, took him down. Good, another region for me, which is providing me with 32 manpower, which in all honesty probably cost me more than 32 manpower to, to get it in the first place. stuff here. Where's this happening? Right here. Very good. That was quick. Get down there and stop him. When will you arrive? Too late. I'm interested to know if these guys here for retraining, do they just cost money, or or what? If they start taking manpower, I'm going to be pissed off about it. And I'll get rid of them. Okay, are they going to attack? Because they'd be pretty silly for, to try. They've got very few men. They just disappeared. Just like that. Whatever. When am I going to be able to colonize that? Probably a little while. When's this ceasefire of ours end? It's already ended. What the fuck are we doing with this then? Oh wait, you. It's supposed to stay there. I actually got a better idea. Now then. Time to end this war. Well, start the war I mean. But end them. Hopefully that was a coincidence. Hopefully that didn't. That wasn't the cause of that rebellion, the fact that I declared war. Eh, we might as well go to war with these guys as well. Why not? Just get it all done. Huh? I didn't know I was at war. Oh well, fucking take the fight to them. They must be allied with, um, Missalia. Well, there you go. there. That's good. Oh, stop taking attrition. Come on. Over there. You're still a disloyal fuck, aren't you? Yep. It's because you're piss poor. I 
I gained men pretty quickly. Should be okay. Uh, good. One at Thapsis. What's going on with Egypt? Uh, they've got 34 units on the border there. So they've got 46 manpower. What have I got as a comparison? 53. So they could raise 46 uh, extra battalions. Good. Yep, whatever. We can colonize this now from Bastatani. Just wait for them to go first. How's the population in Rome? We don't want it to drop too much, because I'm going to keep bloody expanding with these colonizations, which need to happen. Stop these fucking rebellions, uh, not rebellions, but barbarians from showing up. Even though the regions themselves aren't really worth that much to me. Alright, go for it. I will build a forum here. See how we go with it. Even though I don't think there's even a trade route in the first place. No. Doesn't matter. How are they going? Yeah, whatever. They're not taking any attrition. Some mercs here. Trinket pays. Ah, bad timing. Well, at least they'll surrender soon. Ah, great. like it if Carthage went culture Rome. That would be fantastic. That way I'd be able to get an extra 1,600 men a, um, a year in the recruitment pool. That's dropped down a bit. Probably because I keep expanding. Taking the men elsewhere. It's not a big deal. This had 10 population, we could expand into history. Good, got another region. Definitely needs to be. Uh, building the stockade. Good, in Belarus it's Rome. Roman. with you. Why is it red? I don't know. Doesn't matter. We'll deal with them, then go down south, actually. Hang on. Good, dealt with them. strong. Taking out the sway bar, uh, taking out the sway bee, probably not a high lot of, uh, high degree of value in that. Need to keep a legion there at all times. Lost the battle of important.
Vaporeon. All oh, right, <laughs> the, the cavalry got there a bit too quickly. Yeah, fuckhead, if you could have just bloody absorbed them into your fucking troop. Anyway, get another lot of equities to replace them. That was just a mistake on my part, I should have realised that. So I'll be taking these two regions off Massalia this turn, or Massilia, whatever. Absorption, uh, absorption into big regions like, like Tarentum. That was great when that happened. Gained 50 gold. Hang on, hang on, hang on. All things here give me 50 gold. All this fucking shit. all over the place. Excellent. The Gurian's revolting. Okay, that'll surrender any second from now. And when it does, then we'll move into the Guria. The pencil, uh, uh, the pe uh, peasants of Arvernia stirring. Their leader is a for foreigner. Oh, I see. They're trying to. Okay. They're causing some sort of revolt. Yeah, whatever. Bring it on, bitch. Yeah, fifty with gold. Sounds good. These Egyptians are trying to cripple me from the inside. Yeah, fucking good luck to them. Hurry up. Oh shit, that guy's got a ton of friggin' finesse. Might be better off somewhere else, but whatever. Okay. Well, 
Well, that's fine, but we should be able to deal with that pretty easily. Actually, we won't be able to take out that region. So let's just see if we can sue for peace and... Just hang on. Just take these... T oh, fuck's sake. Not asking for much. Just pretty much everything that you've got. Cool. May peace reign for five years before I go and kill you. Uh oh. That was lucky. Maybe some of these regions should have stockades built. I mean, I can afford it, so. Why is it costing more money? Oh, hang on, gotta fix that up real quick. fucking regions have the exact same bloody resources. Come over here. Actually, no, stay where you are. Okay, that's looking like it could become a problem. Good, they were dealt with. When's this gonna be done? Hurry up. More barbarians. Just don't fucking give it a rest, do they? Oh, this is at zero now. That's strange. Population 9.6. Soon they'll be able to expand. And how's Rome doing? Yeah, 7.85. Stable. How's the uh, war exhaustion? It's, it's uh, only at 1%. Not too bad. probably could go and fight them, but I, I might just leave it for now. I have no idea if these guys cost money to replenish. No idea. Ah, I want to see some cultural absorption for fuck's sake. What is taking you so long? Bitch. It's gonna sit there and take attrition, are you? Like a fuckhead. Unfortunately, all these regions are only worth money up until cultural is converted. But if I can look after these regions better than what they did, I can use it to expand. Okay, I think I'll end the video here. 
certainly starting to get a pretty strong empire and I'm actually going to check what year that is in eight, uh, BC because I don't actually know. Uh, I'll have to do a bit of maths on that, which I fucking hate doing. Anyway, that's the end of this video, so like and subscribe. Part 12 is next. Don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time.